Leaders of a true democracy are not elected to randomly select whose rights must be defended, nor to decide which group, already protected under the Charter of Rights, can afford to have their rights ignored. The Constitution is for all Canadians, male and female, and it is the elected official's responsibility to protect everyone equally. A party leader telling Canadians that they will not allow its duly elected members to openly decide on an issue, any issue, is contrary to democracy. And telling elected officials how to vote depicts a dictatorship. If Trudeau's thinking that only those who support pro-choice can run for a position in their party is a more accurate depiction of true democracy, then to remain a true democracy according to this type of thinking means elected officials should only be allowed to make decisions about laws and ordinances that pertain to their gender. This act would ensure that all decisions were made from that gender's understanding of life, that gender's related feelings, that gender's wants and goals. Talk about biased lawmaking. If Trudeau is right, then that would also mean politicians must not be involved with the decision-making process about any issue outside their public training expertise or life experiences. For example, what does a lawyer elected to government know about raising a child with MS if that lawyer's family is not found under the MS umbrella? Using Trudeau's concept, politicians should not be allowed to vote on the rules restricting government support for families who have a child suffering with MS. Only those members who have within their family an MS child could vote. Junior Trudeau is attempting to finish removing from Canadians their right to think, feel and care about themselves, their partner and their family. He is striving to create, for obsessive leaders, a selfish society which favors only the politically correct thinking sections of that society. Canada has sent her military around the world to fight this particular type of evil. His thinking is opposite that of the just society, which the senior Trudeau, his dad, claimed was his goal when he was prime minister. We need the Barnes method of voting and the value vote ballot.